G'day guys, it's Tom Scully from Pretty Mentoring for Training Tip Thursday. Carrying on from our week of spin bowling, we've got Ryan here again, our, our spin bowling mentor, and Ryan's now going to give all you spinners a training tip. Thanks Tom. Yep, so this training tip is absolutely crucial. It was first told to me when I did a spin session at the Centre of Excellence with Greg Matthews. Uh, he said that as a spinner, you need to have a cricket ball in your hand as often as possible. So it needs to be become a part of you. So whenever you get the chance, get a ball in your hand, spin it, and just so it becomes familiar. So that action, the release, the action of your wrist coming over the top of your ball becomes second nature and familiar. So it's almost like a second body, part of your body. So wherever you can, whenever the chance you get, if you're sitting down and you're batting and you, you know your next innings is bowling, make sure you sit down with a ball and you're just spinning it. So you feel that release of your spinning finger and so it becomes something else that you don't have to think about when you come onto bowl. And it's amazing the difference it makes when you sit there and with a ball in your hand, spinning it before you come onto bowl. And even when you're out in the field as well. So make sure that if you're a cover or point and you know that you're about to come onto bowl, make sure the boys get the ball to you. You feel the ball in your hand, spin it a couple of times, and then bowl it to the next guy instead of underarming it, just so that when you come on to, to bowl and start your spell, uh, it's another variable out of the way and you're comfortable feeling that ball spin out of your hand. Really, really important. Have that ball in your hand as much as possible. Another good time to do it, guys, is when you're just sitting at home on the couch, just spin it up and down. Always have that ball in your hand. There should be no excuses. Just get that ball in your hand. Get used to the feeling, something that Ryan talks a lot about. So there we go, guys. That's the last video for the week. Um, like we mentioned earlier in the week, we've put together some. Uh, we've put together an online program for leg spinners. So if you're interested in that, that'll be coming out in the next few weeks. Send us a message, um, and we'll, we'll give you the information about that. We'll thank Ryan for joining us this week. He's given us a lot of information, a lot of knowledge. Hope all you spinners have really enjoyed this week. Cheers. Thanks, guys.